Now, um, hello guys. I would like to be sharing with you some of the things I've discovered so far when it comes to the use of email or when our affiliates are trying to you know, get access to emails we do deliver. Now, we've realized that um, from, from analysis, we've seen some of the complaints that affiliates are sending to us. And after the analysis, we discovered that some persons are are not just should i say they're not just wise i wouldn't like to use that word but some affiliates are not doing the right thing okay i believe in life you have to be creative you have to be innovative you have to try things out yourself okay before you start complaining on issues like this you need to first of all see if there are things you need to do the right way possibly we have google out there to type in your question and ask okay because most of the times we send out these bulk emails and it goes to everyone you record 100 percent successful delivery but we still see affiliates come up to complain that they haven't gotten these emails now um well i'll be discussing with you some of the related um, these are the common issues that we've been facing so far and then which is um, email the de- 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 delivery okay and then basically um, I'll be recommending you some of the things you need to do for you to get your emails, all right? Because most of the time, these emails are sent. It's just that most persons do not use the um, Google or their platform very well. So, they are commonly Gmail addresses, okay? Most of them don't know how to use um, the Gmail services. Now, I'll be using a typical, the typical example I'll be using in a... Uh, um, in this video is going to be the Gmail. Now, um, for example, let's say you fail to receive an email because I know majority of the time what most things do, even me personally, what I do is that whenever someone sends me email, I first of all check my inbox. But it doesn't just stop there. Gmail has some other sections of their services, which includes the promotion, the socials, the spam, and they also have the search functionalities. Now, if you if you happen not to find a mail sent to you, one of the first place, places you need to check, in fact, one of the first places I do use to check is my search functionalities. I use the search bar to check for my emails. Now, there is no how, for example, now, if let me say I signed up on a crypto platform using my Gmail, and then I get a Gmail, a mail to say, and I happen to check it and I don't find it in my inbox. That is the default section. And I happen not to find it. The first place I do use to search for is the search functionalities. Okay, because what happens is that the search functionalities is also going to carry out a search in the promotions, the socials, and also the spams. Okay, so if you check, check your promotion, you can't find there. You check socials, maybe it's hidden, and then you check spam please try as much as possible to use your search functionalities in your emails okay let's take for example these are some of the screenshots now um let's say um that you got a mail from digistem and then one of the first places you need to search for is this search bar use the search in mail okay you see this field that says search in mail so just click on here and then type digistem when you type Digistem, you search for any mail you received. Now, every email that contains Digistem is going to display on your platform, on your Gmail inbox here. So you can click on it to see if there are if there were emails that you missed, you missed out. Say. Now, there is another section I do use, though I I rarely use um, rarely use this section. Okay. Now, these are the menu bar. Just tap on this menu bar here. Just tap on this menu bar. And when you do that, then um, this pop-up will be coming up. This is the menu options coming up. Where you see sections called the promotions, the social. You also have the spam here. Okay? As a spam here. Now, what you have to do, most of the email sent do go to, some of them do go to promotions. Okay, but basically, this is the default section where every email sent is being stored. For example, if Facebook sends mail, you can't find it in primary. You would likely find it in the social section, all right? 
Now, if you sign up on some top websites, companies, hosting companies to say, majority of the times, most of their emails sent to their clients or customers will be sent to the promotion section. Okay? And some other times, there, there are tendencies that those emails will be sent to spam. It doesn't necessarily mean that... Um, is there are, the emails are sent from wrong sources okay there are you know conditions that are beyond the control of the sender okay, that makes people receive emails in their spam so one of the things you need to do when we send messages like this is for you to ensure that you go through all these sections of the gmail services okay depending on the you know the gmail service it may be yahoo or the rest Okay, so ensure that you go through them, especially using the search functionalities so you could find Gmail sent by us, all right? So I just decided to put up this video to help solve some of the challenges that affiliates are facing, all right? And I hope this video is going to help you out there. Please, whenever we are sending messages or sending emails, also ensure that you provide us with the correct emails, okay? Um, this is very important because no matter the emails we are sending, okay, if your email is not correct, the provided emails they are not correct, you won't be able to get this email service. This is a point. This is a this is our, our communication medium we use to communicate to all our affiliates, and we always do this to ensure that all our affiliates get our messages passed across. Okay, so I do wish you a a nice day, happy day. All right, thank you so much, and I I believe I've been able to solve some of the challenges. Are you guys are facing so far i'll see you next time